Om Namah Shivai. My name is Aditya Mehta, and on March 20, 2022, I went to Trambakeshwar to get a Kalsar Dosh puja done. Kalsar Dosh has been troubling me a lot since the past few years, and I decided that it was time to do something about it. So I got in touch with a few pandas from Trambakeshwar and went there on March Shivratri because what could be a more auspicious day? But on reaching Trambakeshwar, I found out that. Whatever goes on there, all the rituals and prayers, all of it is just a money-making business. These people don't even know how to do the pujas properly. All they are after is your money, and money is all they want in the name of God. This is Ajahneshwar Mahadev Ashram, Trambakeshwar's center for Kalsa, those pujas and other important rituals. People come here from far away places to get extremely important rituals performed and they get fooled by these pundits. This is Raman Tiwari, who claims to be the biggest Pandit in Trambakeshwar. He looks at the charts of already scared people and frightens them even more by telling them that they have this curse and that curse and makes them do rituals that they don't need to do at all just so he can take all their money. Another guy at the same ashram, Anurag Guruji, claims to be a very big Brahman. He takes a lot of money to perform rituals but doesn't buy the necessary material and saves money for himself by not using a lot of the paraphernalia that's required for the puja. Talking to many other pundits at Arjuneshwar Mahadev Ashram, it becomes obvious that Trambakeshwar is filled with such pundits who don't want to do any sort of prayer or ritual or anything at all for you and only want to suck you dry. A lot of these so-called pundits don't know how to chant mantras. Most of them do not know who Mansa Devi is. And quite a few of them don't even know who Subramaniam, that's Kartike, Lord Shiv's son, is. Most of the people who go to Trambakeshwar have no idea what the procedure for their puja is. So when these pundits take shortcuts in everything, don't use the necessary material, the required paraphernalia, and don't even try and have the mantras. How will these people even know that they are being fooled? This doesn't mean that every Trambakeshwar Pandit is bad. But these people at Arjuneshwar Mahadev Ashram make Trambakeshwar and all its Pandits seem like cheaters. People like Ramanand Tiwari and Anurag Guruji are the reason why people stop believing in Pandits. They are the reason why people cannot trust Pandits. And even if Five out of hundred pundits in Trambakeshwar are good or real pundits. How are we going to find them? Where are we going to find them? On the phone, all these pundits talk nicely and sweetly and they're all smooth. But they're waiting for you in Trambakeshwar like a crocodile waits for other animals in water. During my Kal Shabdos Puja, when the pundit brought nine laughable snake idols on a plate, I realized that not only was he not going to use all the required material, the necessary paraphernalia, but also that he was going to take major shortcuts from then on. Now I know why Shri Kukke Subramanya and Kala Hasti and all these other places that do these big pujas make fun of Trambakeshwar's Kalsa Dosh Puja. I told them that I wanted to do only the Kalsa Puja and nothing else. <laughs> But I did not get my money back because these people are thieves and only know how to lie and cheat in the name of God. Thank <laughs> you.
The Rahu Ketu Shanti Haman went as expected. They made me sit at somebody else's Havan after those people got done with it. And the Pandit then chanted the Rahu Mantra three times and the Ketu Mantra thrice as well. And they made me pay 3000 bucks for this. The Poojas and Havans I do at home are 10,000 times better than this nonsense. So many people go back home from here believing that they got this done and that done unaware that they only lost money and these greedy pundits this is how they earn money by lying to and cheating people in the name of God these shameless pundits have ruined Kambakeshwar's name and reputation forever